Hey everyone, let's do a cash condensing. It is by far one of my favorite videos to watch and sometimes it's my favorite video to actually do as long as I get it all right and don't get all mixed up and, and discombobulated. So we're going to start with my sinking funds because this one is the fat boy and all of this money's needs to get out of this binder and go to my high yield savings account so that it can be drawing some interest. Now, I've got some prop money. This is from Two Sister Bees. It is my clams. I have a I have 50s, one, 100s, a 500, and a 1,000. I don't know if I'll need all of them, but we'll see. So we're going to start with trash and I can't really do anything with it because it comes out next month. I'm not going to put anything in, but I'll come back to it and condense this down a little bit more and that'll be okay. Uh, licensing. Let's see if I can do anything in here. 10, 20, 30, 40. Nope. It has 140. So we will come back to it and take out some of those tens. Mardi Gras I know I can do something with because it's it's gotten quite full 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 70 80 5 20 40 60 70 85 so I'm going to pull out a hundred 20 40 60 70 80 and put this in the bank see what we can do with that and that'll give it $300 in the bank and we're going to write this down so that I don't uh, forget what I put in because whatever's on this notepad right here is the dollar amount that I'm going to have to have left and let's go ahead and go back to my licensing and let's take out these tens 10 20 40 20 40 and that can stay like that my trash let's see let's take these 10 10 let's do the this 20 and it's that's it as far as it's gonna go I need to keep the cash in there so that takes care of those two let's see what else we have licensing and Mardi Gras we've done Christmas I know I can put some money up it already has a twelve hundred dollars let's see what we've got 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 80 90 95 2 Fantastic. Let's give it a couple of hundred dollar placeholders and let's save that up. That is that sinking fund is coming along very nicely. And we put 200 in there and that gives it 1400, a thousand, one, two, three, four. Beautiful. And a vacation. Let's see what we can do with it. It has a thousand in the bank. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 75, 80. Let's get rid of this and put that in there. So 180. So it now has a thousand. One hundred and eighty dollars. Car tags. I'm pretty sure I can take some out of here. It has five, six, seven already. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, a hundred. Tell you, I always lose my sort quick. I have no idea where it's at. 20, 35, 45, 
50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, let's do this. All of my bills. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. So let's do a 20 and a 10. There is no picking out the pretty bills down here because I think every single one of them are horrible. So car tags is getting 100. And that gives it 800 in the bank. And subscriptions. Let's see what we can do with it. Ah. One, two, three, four. Oh, nice. If there's a hundred here, we can put a $500 placeholder. And I see right now there's not. 20, 30, 40, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 67. So, 5, Six and seven, sixty-seven. Okay. The more you do this with the cash condensing, the easier it gets to figure out where all your money needs to go. Now that does it for subscription. My house fund. Okay, this is new. We have a hundred in the bank that I transferred over from our trash. This is money from Shut the Box Savings Challenge that I completed last week and also my 24 envelope challenge that I finished last week. And it has $392 plus this hundred. So what I think I'm going to do is this is money that I've set aside. This is from our, the month of June rollover from our cash, I'm sorry, our grocery, dining, and gas. Anything left in those three envelopes get put, gets put somewhere else. I'm going to take, because this is $392, I'm gonna take $8 out of here, round it up to make it an even four, and that will start off July with our house fund at $500. We did have 10 in there, but I had to use it to um, put the down payment uh, to purchase the property that's next door along with some other funds. So we're going to put eight in here. And then I'm still trying to figure out what to do with this. Uh, it was it's 440. Take out the eight. It'll be what? Um, 432 what would you do with it would you bulk up sinking funds or put it in bulk up some of your cash your variable spending or would you put it to debt or would you put it in this house fund I'd be interested to know what you would do um, all of them are good things to do and I don't know exactly how quickly I'll need a good about a good amount of money in my house fund so tell me what you would do with that but for now we're going to set it aside make sure I want to make sure I have uh, $400 here and that is 1, 2, uh, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 20, 30, 40, wait a minute, 300, 350, 370, 80, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and 100. So yes, that makes $400. And I'm gonna put house is going to get 400. I'm gonna put this 100 back and I'm gonna put a nice pretty $500 placeholder in there. And let's put all of this up. And there's a nice little 50, 20s, 10s, 5s, and 1s. All right. Okay. Then we've got house insurance. Let's see what it has. 
200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 5, 200. Okay, good deal. Let's do house insurance. Is going to get 200. I'm, I may have to pull some more uh, $100 placeholders because they're getting thin up there. But that's okay because I printed out a bunch. So now house insurance has $400. So that means next month I'll be able to put a $500 placeholder in there. Property taxes I don't think can be go to the bank. I usually do the bank when it's $100. 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 80. So 20, 10, 20, 30, and 40. 20, 80 total. Okay. And this is property taxes on our current house. Property tax land, that's our property next door. And I'm just going to condense these two tens for this 20, and that gives it 30 still. The campaign fund, let's see what it has. It has 150 in the bank. 20, 40, 60, 81. And let's say campaign 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 2. Wow. Okay. So it now is going to have $450 in the bank. I like getting all this money out of my house too for safety purposes. It all goes in my husband's big gun safe that's in that's hidden in the closet and all that good stuff, but it's still good to not have it in my house. And nationals it cannot be condensed anymore. It's got 50. Okay, so that is all. Wow, look how thin. Within another month it'll be slammed full again. <laughs> that's no lie let's see if we can do anything in our revolving as always these three are empty for the month of July uh, spending I'm gonna leave medical I am going to leave because we dip in and out of this on a regular basis pets I usually don't put anything in the bank for these because they are, in fact, our revolving. We go into them every month. Um, so basically, we're just looking at them to see if we want to condense anything. So, nope, nothing can be just done there. Let's check out low priority and see what we have. My household, same thing. Um, I'm gonna leave because we don't, I don't want it in, it doesn't need to be in the bank. It needs to be here. Car maintenance, now I can put some in the bank. That's okay. 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. It already has 150 in the bank. So let's put another 50 and exchange those 50s for hundreds. So 5, 10, 15, okay, 10. What am I doing here? We're gonna do that. How about that? Okay, we're gonna, let me do this this way first so I don't mess myself up. I'm gonna put another 50 and put car maintenance. 50 and then I'm gonna pull these 450s for two 100s how about that one two three four there we go and it has 200 10 15 16 17 18 19 yep 219 mom's not going to the bank Charlie's not going to the bank Heather Bear, she's got, she's just got 30 in cash, gonna leave that. Same thing with Tyler, 30 Grand Nuggets. It also has 30. 
and I am going to put I'm going to put all of our um, emergency fund as prop bills because it sits in the bank and this way I can just pretty much glance at it and see what it is so we have three thousand and ninety dollars I'm gonna round that up one two three thousand uh oh let me grab a couple more hundreds which that's the beauty of prop money you need some more you just print it out I wish it I wish it was that way in real life wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> so, 3100 So, that'll be good enough. And then, that way, I can just keep up with what's in there easier. Alright, that does it for that one. Now, what I really need to do as well is uh, condense this big saving challenge. It's going to be fun to go into the bank or condense actually I'm gonna condense it in bigger bills that's what I'm going to do <laughs> 20 40 60 80 10 20 30 40 80 90 100 okay 20 40 60 80 90 100 10 god what is wrong with me y'all come on 20 40 60 80 90 100 all right let's give that a hundred and let's 10 20 30 and 40 and let's give that 20s and that will be condensed for 100 honeys uh track to 1000 10 20 five six seven okay and twist and save has 40 and that now has 40 again shut the box just has 20 we started this game over my penny challenge this is penny challenge from uh, beautifully me and you so it's gonna have its dollars it's not my actual coins my coins is in an actual coin jar 10 20 30 okay so let's take out two tens and take a 20 20 40 60 81 okay that's 105 I'm sorry, 110, 15, 16, 17. In the penny challenge. Roll the dice. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Okay, I'm going to take all of this and get another 20 because I'm out of hundreds. And honestly, I do not like counting that 50. So we'll just leave it out. 20, 40, 60, 81. It's still going to be condensed. It's just going to be more. Funko gets time. 10, 20, 30, 40. And we will get two 20s. 20, 40, 60, 80. Triple play. 10, 15, 20. Whoops, get in your slot. And then fives, and that'll give me a 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So we'll put those back and get a 10. Just one, just one. Did you see that jump out? Try to get in my hand. Okay, so triple play. Place your bets. 10, 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 66, 67. So let's leave all of that. 10, 20, 30, 40, 55, 60. Okay. 
what is the weather like where you guys are it is on the gulf coast we have had a hundred and twenty how much did i just put in there 60. <laughs> oops almost messed up here on the gulf coast it is a hundred and twenty heat index so this mama stays in the house with the air conditioner in the fans I, I do not get out in this weather like this unless I'm in the water somehow and saver spin has 15 we can't condense that anymore Tetris 10 20 30 10 20 30 40 let's give it to 20s 5 10 15 20 I see where all my fives and stuff are. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, 20, 40, 60, 65, 66. And save Z. 10, 20, 35, 45. 20, 45. Put all those up. And that does it for this savings challenge binder. My last savings challenge binder. I think we're pretty good. I'm not going to, well, let me see. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, let's do that. 10, 15, 16, 17. This is my $5 bills. I'm going to leave it that way. My A bucks, I don't take anything out. Star notes, I'm not taking anything out. This is the biggie. It's got so much in it. And I definitely want to take that down a notch. And it already has a 50. I wish I had a 100. But anyway, we're going to leave all those. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. You know what I'm going to do though? That's 50 all tens yep because it already has a 50 in there I'm going to give it that 50 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 all right let's do that and let's get some of these ones out of here all right let's put two three four and let's get 25 out oh that's gonna be so nice so it now has let's see 50 100 20 40 60 80 200 20 40 45 46 47 48 49 249 dollars when it reaches 300 I'm pulling it out and putting it somewhere else because honestly this one is the let's play with the companion cards from two sister bees honestly it can go on forever and ever so once it hits three i'm going to take it out and that makes that one way way smaller okay here is my numbers there i'm pulling out the calculator oh miss the calculator I love how beautifully me and you says that. She's, it's, it just tickles me to death. Makes me smile every time I hear it. So let's see how much I pulled out in cash and replaced with prop money. And then make sure this is there. Okay. Looks like it's going to be... $1,350. Let me do that another time just to make sure. $1,350. Okay, now let's see what we have, and I'm going to write it down. As I count it up, just in case. 
because you never know what happens. I went ahead and made some other change other places. So let's see what we have in going back to the bank. And it should reach up to $13.50. Let's hope it does so I can get this out of my house. Okay. All right, that's seven twenty. And in tens, try to jump out of my hand. 50 and 10s, 5s, my ATM does not give out 5s, I have to physically go into the bank, I can get 10s, 20s, and 1s out of my ATM, but, so if I've got 5s, I swap them out and keep some of them, so that's why this stack is way smaller than it was, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, Now, let's hope this is uh, $45. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, and forty-five. Oh my goodness. Yay! And we have thirteen fifty going back to the bank. Okay, that's all I have for you guys this evening. My next video will be a cash stuffing for the first week in July. I'm so glad that June is over and I get so excited about closing out a month because I get to see how much we have put back, how much we've spent, and if we've met our goals and not spent all of our money. Uh, it's just all around exciting. So thank you guys for watching. And I hope y'all have a great night and I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.